Well, if you grew up in church as I did, maybe you remember singing the old hymn from the hymn book, Give of your best to the master. This is Pastor Hayton and another Lower Lights devotional. And I'd like to just share with you some of my thoughts on giving God the very best that we have. I think that my little devotional day probably inspired by the fact that I went to my physician today to get a follow-up visit from my yearly physical. And as he went over my blood work, why, he just kept talking about how everything looked good. And at the top of the page, he wrote, everything looks good, excellent. Well, you generally write superb. This time he used the word excellent, but I'll settle for that. And I thought as I was coming home, how blessed I am. Now, I'm not a young man anymore. My hearings get a little bit dull. In fact, as I told the nurse, as I asked her to speak up a little bit while she was uh, taking my vitals, I said, I'm getting a little bit hard of hearing, and it's getting so bad that people can talk about me even before I leave the room. So I am getting a little bit hard of hearing, and uh, my joints sometimes ache a little bit, and I get up after sitting a while and kind of stove up a little bit, and I told the doctor, I said, you know, I find things that I used to do so easily a little bit more difficult to do. And he looked at me and said, well, maybe age has something to do with that. And so I know that there's the normal uh, things that take place as we grow older. This body is going to deteriorate. The natural progression of life is towards death. And so we're going to uh, find ourselves, this old body, wearing out. A lot of people go and get new body parts, and I hope I don't have to do that anytime soon, but it's remarkable how they can replace a knee or a shoulder or other joints that need to be replaced. And, and uh, you know, modern medicine and technique has uh, extended life and the quality of life for older people. And if the time comes that I need any of that, I guess I'll probably submit to it because I want to uh, stay healthy. And I thought about it as the doctor gave me a pretty good bill of health. I thought, I owe a lot to the Lord. So many of my friends that have gone through heart surgery and, and other uh, cancer experiences and other surgeries, and yet I've been blessed so very much. And I just thought I thank God for the energy that I have. And, and even though I've always had a desire to give him my very best, I want to continue to give him the very best that I have. Poet said, give up your best to the master. Give him the strength of your youth. Well, I started pastoring, preaching at a fairly young age, and I'm happy to say that uh, God, for nearly 52 years now, has had my commitment to ministry and my commitment to the Church of God Holiness. I didn't go off and give the best years of my life to another denomination, another work, but I've been faithful and loyal to the church that uh, took me in and nurtured me and educated me and feel like that I owe them a lot. So I'm going to, not only if I give them the strength of my youth, I plan to throw my soul's fresh glowing ardor into the battle for truth. And I just intend to keep on doing my best for the Lord. My best isn't very, very well, very good. I know it falls short of what a lot of people's poor effort does. My best effort perhaps doesn't match their poorest, but I know all God asks of me is for me to do my best. When I come down to the end, I Know that we sometimes sing that song, I wonder have I done my best for Jesus. I don't want to wonder, I want to know that I've done my best. I struggle with the weakness of the flesh, the frailty of humanity. I'm not a real smart person. I go through my battles and, and subjected to uh, difficulties in life, but I can look back and say I want to give God my best. And today I'm more determined than ever to give God the very best that I have, to do the best that I can with his help and grace. Heavenly Father, thank you that thou dost permit us to labor for you. May we just continue to do our best, Lord. Give the very best that we have. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 
Well, I'll see you tomorrow, Lord willing, on the Lord Light's devotional here with Pastor Hayton. Goodbye now.